Hello everybody. Today we're gonna I'm gonna teach you how to install the item mod. Wee! The item mod there for 173 from beta 173 of Minecraft. The V1.1.02 of the item mod. So what we're gonna do is get on a lot until we are seeing this line we need the donate button okay and what we're gonna do is sorry for that. what we're gonna do is oh is just download all of this six things I mean you only need five but if you want to use the single player commands mod you need to download this one too so we need the mod loader the audio mod the player api the shock a age pi r 5.1 and the afr mod of course so what we're gonna do here is after we, you press the mod loader, you get this Rishgumis. Rishugamis. Sorry for that. I, I, don't, I hope I said it correct. You're gonna get down till the mods, and the first one gonna be the mod loader for beta 1.73. Um, if you want to support him, download, download the through Edfly, Edfly. Uh, but if you want to do it first, faster, download it in the direct. So you see, more lower. Now we're gonna get down a little bit more to the audio mode for the one uh, the one point seven o one. But it supports the one point seven point three as well so you need to download it too as you see now you can close it now we're gonna open the player API gonna wait press skip add after the timer and in Medif Mediafire, just play. click here to start download from Mediafire. Download it, the player API. Um, and the last thing is Shark AHPI R5.1. Wait, again. And press keypad again. And click here to start download from Mediafire again. Waiting. And it's downloaded. All those are here. If you see the numbers here, ignore them. It's because I already downloaded it. I mean, this I have downloaded it five times, this two, twice, and more. And I'm gonna go into the item mode download here. We're gonna wait again. And wait here until it downloads. After I press. I already didn't download it. Well, it's about 23 megabytes. So I'm not gonna wait it. Um, now, what you're gonna do. If you have Windows 7 or Vista, you're gonna just press the start button. And in the search, I'm gonna press percent app data percent. As you see the roaming folder. If it doesn't get anything here, just press enter. But I have it, so you see. You're gonna get you're gonna go to mine dot minecraft 
as, as you see, you have I have here until uh, we're already in mode loader, modes, and more. But for now, I'm gonna teach you how to. For the editor, you need a clean jar for the install. So I'm gonna teach you how to get a clean jar. So what you're gonna do? You're gonna take the saves folder of you, copy it, and just paste it, paste it, sorry, in the desktop. I already did, so I don't need. Now we're gonna go back to roaming and delete the dot minecraft folder all, all of it like gone by the way if you have xp just type run and press enter you're gonna get this window this window you do, do the same like percent out data percent and it's gonna be the same so keep this folder here and go to your games folder and start minecraft after you delete it your username and password gonna be deleted so just log in again I love to do a man password and log in what it's gonna do it's gonna download it the dot minecraft folder again as you see here the folder is here again now it's downloading the file files in the fol folder in the meanwhile we're gonna get get back into your browser open your downloads and go to the mod loader and open its rar window okay so yeah, we have here the mod loader and the Minecraft finished download. After we finished, close Minecraft. Close it for good. And now go go back into a dot Minecraft folder, open the bin folder, and right you need for this like or seven zip or WinRAR or something like that and just right click minecraft.jar do open with and pre and just choose your uh, archiver I'm, I'm using WinRAR, WinRAR for this so I'm gonna choose WinRAR and that's what opens here you have all the minecraft files and folders you not need to touch them you're not allowed to touch them if you don't want to if you're not a modder so what you're gonna do is take all those files except these two or maybe you have three dots here don't take this just gr grab them all and just drag them into the minecraft.jar winner now what you need to do is just press ok after you do that you need to go to the meta in folder and just delete it and as you see nothing is here I'm gonna close the mod loader right now and open now the audio mod and we're gonna do the same process just take all those drag them into the minecraft jar and press ok close it again now do it with the player api take all those into your minecraft.jar press ok and close now the shock AHPI you don't need to copy the readme so only open the pin folder here go to the bottom take all those except again for these two dots folder 
and just drag it and press OK. Now we can close it. Now we got into the interesting uh, thing. By the way, if you want to install the, the single player commands, I'm gonna show you now how to do it. You're gonna take the single player commands, take all the class ones and just drag them here and press OK. But you remember this DC file? This that you downloaded from here, the download uh, single player commands patch. So I'm gonna take it. Sorry, sorry, we don't messy. Take the DC file, drag it into the Minecraft.jar and paste. Not paste, I mean release it and press OK, like we did before. And now you have you need to take the world edit.jar just drag it into the bin folder that's all and now you have single player commands too so what you're doing now I'm gonna open the Acer zip you see this is the Acer 1.7.3 v1.02 zip you're gonna go into the jar folder sorry jar folder and take all those files and again drag them into the minecraft.jar and press ok that's gonna take a little while if you and now after you did that go back to into your dot minecraft folder get into the resources folder and take the mod folder and put it in as you can see here and now you can close this close this and close the minecraft.jar folder and uh, not folder sorry the rar and go into minecraft so I'm gonna log in now If you see this black screen, I mean, for the first time, you're gonna get a little a black screen for like um, five seconds. Don't worry, that's not a black screen. That's only the menu that loads. But after that, it'll be much faster, like as on my computer. I'm gonna turn a little bit the music off. screen as you see you have the editor mode Whee! I'm gonna show you create new world create new world and now I'm generating the level as you see you have the inventory of the editor mod and not let me check just for a second what the ID of glowstone just a second we will show you because I didn't install the um, I mean if you install the too many items mod it will show you on the side of the inventory but I didn't install it now, so that's it. So Glowstone is 18, is 89. Okay, so slash i 89 64. We have Glowstone slash i 8 1. This is the water for the portal. So now I'm gonna build the portal. I'm gonna show you how to build it. It's uh, just like the nether one. As you see, four, one, two, three, four high, one, two, three, four high, and close it, and just put a 
bucket of water. I'm using water, but just put bucket of water in the middle, and that's what you get. Like another portal for the egg. You stand in the middle. It's gonna load the egg. It's gonna take a while for the first time, but after that, it'll be faster. Building terminal and as you see we are in the header Woohoo yeah here you have Xenite and all the header as you can see everything is here you can see the monsters not monsters I mean uh, mobs still generating so it's a little bit laggy this is the first time you see the the silver dungeon see all the sheep offs and that's it I guess well thank you and we'll see you in the next time see ya